Minasan o Karina Sai. Today, we've got someone who literally started from the bottom, but with hard work and dedication, climbed her way to the top. Sai Oska, born October 10th, 1995, in the Kanto region. Shoutouts to Pokemon. Currently a freelancer, but she was affiliated with Ace Crew Entertainment up until June of this year. While her music is under the label Avex Tracks, Sai's first experience with music was when she played a toy piano her mother had bought her and she even wrote her first song at the age of five. She belonged to her music committee in elementary school and was responsible for the trombone in her middle school's brass band club. Sai never sought out to become a seiyu. She was always more interested in music. When she was 15, she started playing the acoustic guitar and singing as a street performer for four years. And after that, she debuted as a voice actress. Then she started to learn how to play the electric guitar as well. In December of 2014, on Christmas Day in fact, Saichi was recruited to join Bushy Road's music franchise, Bang Dream, as the guitarist Tai Hanazono. At this point in her career, she had no voice acting experience. She was formally introduced as a member of Pop and Party during its Second Life concert in June of 2015, being the second to last member of the band introduced. And we're just gonna skip 2016 and go straight to 2017, when the anime for Bang Dream aired and she voiced Tai. This year, she also voiced a character named Satori Hime in Megami Maguri, a Nintendo 3DS game. Her alongside Pom Pom Party sang the ending theme for Future Card Buddy Fight X, their song BOF. 2018, again, her alongside Papipa sang the song Sa Iko, the opening for Future Card Buddy Fight Ace. This year, she also temporarily performed with the band The Third, aka Beta Reza Ceylon. She was their guitarist up until Rico Pin took over a few months later. 2019, she debuted as a solo performer with her song What's Your Identity. This was used as the opening to a Chinese anime named Egg Car, also having a very minor role in episode 1 of Bermuda Triangle Colorful Pastel, as the character Laura, by the way. Her first and only photo book that I'm aware of came out, and it is called Sai Stain. Very odd choice. She also technically debuted into D4DJ this year, but I'm going to cover that right now with 2020. This is her second multimedia franchise, by the way, joining the band Rondo and voicing the character Nagisa Tsukimiyama as their only guitarist. As with most idols associated with Bushiroad, she is in the Rebirth For You franchise, specifically voicing Juri Torigo. Her debut mini album was also released, titled Avant Title. 2021, she voiced Yurika Hiyami in Remake Our Life. She also released a song titled A Stan Gun When I Kiss. Well, that is how Twitter translated it, at least. It is actually titled Boko Gaki's Shitari Stun Gun. The music video for it, she made and edited herself. This song was also on her second mini album, Star Kaido. 2022, as I stated in the intro, she left Ace Crew and became a freelancer. This also meant the closing of her fan club, called Saichi Go. She will have her first solo live on October 9th and 10th. That second day will be on her birthday. And I've actually already mentioned all of her video game roles, her Bandori D4DJ and Megami Maguri roles. Also, I couldn't find any live action or foreign dubbings, unfortunately. But as for live action appearances, well, she's performed with Pop and Party at like every Bandori Live since 2016. And with Rondo at all the D4DJ Lives since 2019. She was also with Poppy Pa at the Annie Sama in 2016, 2018, and 2019. That 2019 festival also having the Wicked crossover with Jam Project featuring Poppy Pa and all the other performers that were on stage prior to them. This year she will be there with Rondo. Pretty sure she's also been at Animax Musics a few times with Poppy Pa. Saichi is 164 centimeters, or 5 foot 5, one of the taller seiyu. I have two song recommendations for you, one from each group, those being Poppin Party's Returns and Rondo's Movement. Her social media presence includes Twitter and two Instagrams. One is more personal and the other is more business. She is actually very active on her Instagram, posting a lot and liking a lot of other Seiyu's photos, especially her Rondo bandmate Sunko. Saichi seems to be a big fan of hers, and she is just honestly very good friends with Sunko in general. But aside from Sunko, she is also very close with Risa Sumigi and Riko Kohara, and she has a TikTok account as well. She is left-handed, though she plays guitar right-handed. Funny enough, a fellow Bandori guitarist Riko Pin is also left-handed. And like I said before, Riko is the one who took over as Rasa's guitarist after Saichi went to focus more on Papipa. And that is just a funny coincidence to me that they are both left-handed. When Sai gets stuck while practicing the guitar, she tends to watch TV at the same time, which I can relate to, I do the same while writing scripts. Aside from writing the music for most of her songs, she also writes the lyrics and she really enjoys putting English words into her songs. Many aspects of Otae's character were inspired by Sai herself, such as when Otae conducted a street performance during the second season of the anime. Tae's friendship with Reza Seelan's Rei Wakana is also based on Sai's connections with Rei's voice actress. 
that being the lovely lady named Rachel. Her and Sai used to belong to the same agency. At one point, Sai was a regular on Rachel's radio corner, Our World Radio, on Act 5 Station. Saichi has hosted three different corners in Bandoi TV, one of them being called Saichi and Rico Peen's Jam Session, where she and Rico shared Bandoi announcements through improvised songs. The second one was called Saichi and Kuroharu's Secret Talk, which seemed to be a variety show. The third was Garupa Bancho Saichi, where she challenged guests to certain games while acting like a bancho, which is a delinquent wearing a high school girl's uniform. Speaking of delinquents, her alongside Risa Sumigi and Kanan Shizaki are known as the Yabai Trio. Yabai usually meaning dangerous or mischievous. <laughs> Sai's favorite anime is Magical Girl Lyrical Nanaha. Her favorite genre of manga is romance. She also admires Nana Mizuki, Miyuki Sawashiro, and Joe Hisashi. According to Riko Kohara, Saichi is slightly airheaded but also very reliable and level headed. She once owned 23 rabbits, 50 goldfish, 4 koi, and 1 pigeon. I've heard of crazy cat ladies, but this is next level. Her hobbies include eating, reading manga, taking baths, running, writing music, and taking photos of trees. Her favorite foods are hamburgers, ramen, and oshiruko, which is apparently a dessert containing porridge and a boiled azuki beans. So obviously as I've been saying Saichi many times, this is her current nickname, but before that it was Sai Pyon. Pyon being the noise for the sound effect of a small creature jumping, like a rabbit, or 23 rabbits. Aside from guitar, she also knows how to play piano, probably from that toy that she had when she was very young. And finally, during a live performance, Saichi got way into the song and started to headbang and accidentally hit her mic right off the stand. I mean, it's called Bang Dream for a reason, right? Luckily, Aimee seemed to be the only member to notice. To end this off and making this video just a little bit longer, Saichi is one of the girls who hasn't really branched out too far of her main roles. Being a seiyu isn't exactly her main goal it seems, she is definitely more of a musician. Poppin' Party alone has near 50 original songs, not to mention all of their covers and the songs she has with Rondo along with her solo music. But she's come so far since her beginnings, just playing in street corners now she's selling out stadiums. And with that, thank you so much for watching, I hope you've learned something new about this lovely angel. And if you have enjoyed, you know what to click or to press if you're on mobile. Next time I'll be talking about a certain festival that is literally about to start and features many, many of our favorite idols and seiyo. I hope to see you there.